This is a tutorial to guide you how you can share your Steam library games with your family members and specifically how you can share the game on a single PC with different user accounts. And what I mean user account is the operating system user account for example Windows account or Mac account and each account have their own Steam account and I saw other tutorial never talk about this one so I made this tutorial for example we have two people with two Windows accounts and with two Steam accounts if these two people doesn't share and they have to buy the game two times and install the game two times and occupy two times of the hard drive space if you just set up family share and these two people are using two separate computers then it is okay you just need to buy the game one time but you need to install the game two times and occupy two times of the hard drive space but if they are using the same computer then it is quite wasteful you have to install the game in two different places and it take two times of the space now let's have a demo I am the first user. I want to share my games with the third user. Let's log in into the third user. The first thing you want to make sure is go to preferences or settings. Check your accounts. Then click manage Steam Guard account. And manage Steam Guard. The Steam Guard have to be enabled, cannot be turned off. All the users Steam Guard have to be enabled included the user share the library and the user receive the library and second you will have to change where your game is going to be installed on your hard drive which is called a steam library then you click the downloads tab and click this steam library folder and here you can see where your library is located it's located at users your username library application support in steam and the problem is here it's under your user folder your user folder is supposed to be kept private only you can view your user folder not others on the same pc for example me so if this library is inside this user folder then others cannot access so what we are going to do is create a folder that everybody on this computer can view and set this folder as the game library so on the mac i will choose the application folder because application folder is accessible by all the users on the same computer so i will go to application folder and create a folder called the games inside the games folder i will create another folder called the steam lab because i already created it so i don't have to create it again after that you click this plus icon and navigate to the folder you just created it so i created it under application games and steam lab so i go to application not users application games and the, use, the folder I created is called Steam Lab and select and remember both users need to do the same after that select this newly created library because I already installed a game on it so it already show it have game inside and click this dot 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 and make this one default a default library means newly installed the game will be here so if you already have games here you can try to move your games to the new library or uninstall the game in the old library and reinstall in the new library on windows you can do the same go to settings and download manage your steam library folder but here i already set up the steam library so it's automatically become c drive games steam app but by default it should also inside your user uh, folder so you can do the same 
create a new empty folder on your D drive or C drive where everybody can access then you add the new library and set the new library to your default library after settle all the library things for both accounts and you should able to see the game inside the library if the library is pre-installed games but you cannot play it you see here is a purchase button as a library owner you need to authorize other users on this computer to play your games and, uh, both users I suggest to do the same go to the family tab and then check this box but you see nobody is in the user list don't worry you just click OK first now you need to log out your Steam account and then ask the library owner to log in his or her account on your PC or on your Windows or Mac account after the owner log in Make sure this button become red or is not present. You just click it and key in the password and make sure it's become red or not present. Then you go to settings or preferences again. Go to family and check this box and allow other Steam account to use your games. And after that, you log yourself out and ask your family members to log back in and now they should able to play your game without purchase or install on Windows the process is the same basically everybody logging into your or his or hers Steam then log out and then in family tab you click authorize other users to use this library if this helped you please like and subscribe